What is up guys, I thought I'd bring you some more content. I've been really, really sick, but I'm just going to get into this. So, I'm going to teach you how to play Rivals with this build. So, Harvester first, uh, War Factory, and then War Dogs. So, what the idea is, the idea behind this is keep all the enemy on their side. And all the infantry, make them try and build another unit with your War Dogs, because War Dogs are only 10 Tiberium. Uh, while you're doing this, keep building War Dogs. Try and micro a little bit. Uh, you see the militant squad, don't worry about that so much. You want to aim down the laser squad, another war dog here. It's more all about the back presence on the right side while you get while you get ready to build a uh, predator tank. Now I will have my deck load out below on the description and everything like that. Now shockwave uh, troopers right now, they're really good anti-infantry, really really good. So build one of them. I see the bikes, so I'm going to build a pit bull. Uh, war dogs are still keeping them busy, they're only 10 Tiberium. So it's not that expensive to lose them. I tank out the bikes here. Uh, buggy out from him. They're, his buggy's really, really good against my um, really good against my um, infantry. I actually accidentally made a mistake here and didn't move the pit bull on the top of the left fast enough. So he actually gets the nuke off on me. There you go. He gets the first nuke. That was bad by me. I build another pit bull. So now it's maybe uh, vehicles. I need another shock. Right, I need another shock uh, trooper just to take care of this infantry. I see the scorpion tank and now my, my predator tank will be able to take his out even though he's a level above mine if I just micro it correctly. It's going to start hitting the shockwaves. I put my infantry first so he hits that. Another predator tank. So the main build behind this is just keeping them busy on their side. Uh, keep building predator tanks and pit bulls. Uh, I have hammerheads ready in case he switches up to air. Uh, my deck, like I said, will be on the description. I didn't have to build hammerheads this game, to be honest with you. Another shockwave artillery. Now you try and take out the harvester as well while you can. I have to be very careful here because he got the first nuke. So I know he'll probably try and get it off again. So I have to be very careful. That's why I built war dogs. War dogs are really good for just holding the pattern for a quite a little bit while. I need to take out that buggy, so I'm going to bring that tank back here. Uh, Harvest is nearly dead, it's nearly dead, so I'm going to bring that tank up there, try and pick off that Harvester, I need to build another war dog, and it's so close right here, luckily my tank gets on that pad, and I transfer that one over there, he's got no Harvester now, so he shoots me with a Tiberian missile, but I keep the dogs alive, dogs over there, he has no Harvester, so he's going to keep building that uh, unit to try and get the pads, I have to I have to get this pad, so more tanks, more war dogs, uh, tanks to counter the uh, bikes and the war dogs to counter the infantry because the war dogs are pretty good. Whack that back on that pad. I nearly mucked up there. Tanks go back on the pad. Another tank on the bottom as well, so there's more tanks. I could go tech right now. I probably should have got a Titan, but they're pretty slow, so I need to get the first nuke off before I try to. Um... There you go. There's the first nuke. Second nuke, sorry. Got the second nuke off, so now I know I'm pretty in a dominance position. You never really want to go second harvester either. Uh, second harvest is bad because it takes up one of your uh, supply pads, uh, supplies for your units. Uh, more shockwave units right now. So this is a really good deck. It's, it's winning me a lot of games against Northern GDI. It's winning me a lot actually. But you lose your fair share, mate. Uh, bomb comes out, come here, bomb. Can't really dodge it in time. Got my Titan out now. So the Titan's a really, really good unit. It takes so much damage. The Harvester didn't die, but I'm just building the Titan to whack on the front because he would never kill it in time. It's so tanky and it does so much damage, you know. See, you can take hits upon hits. I'm using the Overcharge. Overcharge is really, really good. Get you in there. And yeah, there you go. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to let me know in the description. Um, I couldn't do the best because I'm all sick at the moment. I'll leave a little thing in the description but yeah thank you very much guys hope you enjoyed the video and i will see you next time